Fighting for equality, BYU students and community members protested against discrimination based on sexuality on campus. Fox 13 News reporter Mythali Gooby spoke to people passionate about the cause and what they see as a need for change. Love not hate! Love not hate! Cheering for change. To help make BYU's campus more inclusive. It's all about quality, that we want to be treated the same um, as straight students and the same as any American. With pride flags, signs, and spirit, on National Coming Out Day, people took to the streets to help raise awareness about the challenges faced by LGBTQ plus students at BYU. That queer students are not allowed to date, where, where um, heterosexual students are allowed to date. Queer mentors not being allowed to um, disclose their identity, their orientation. There's um, teachers not being allowed to have too many safe space stickers or to have rainbows. The Black Menaces helped organize the rally because even though BYU is a private school, it still receives federal dollars. So they hope that every student there can have a right to express who they are. And so we want to end the legal discrimination of queer students at religious universities. Uh, we still believe that religious freedom is important but we don't believe that it should be used to discriminate against anyone in particular. So along with these BYU students and community groups, other religious universities across the nation also had strikeout queerophobia walkouts to help fight for equality. <laughs> Nate Bird with Black Menaces says it's vital for people to see how important race is in the LGBTQ plus conversation and for all of us to support those who need it. Because a lot of times the face of the, of the LGBT movement can be um, you know, not as diverse as we want it to be. And we, we want people to remember that there are people of all creeds, colors, and, and sexualities as a part of that movement. Megaphone in hand, people also shared their stories. I'm a queer student, so I've had to live every day for the past year and a half, just feeling all these negative emotions, feeling like I can't be myself, feeling like I have to hide certain parts of my life. A common theme, seeing people gather like this makes them believe that change is possible. It makes me excited. It gives me hope for the future. I think this is a big deal and it makes me feel like I'm not alone. In Provo, I am Mike Legal B. Fox 13 News, Utah.